brilliant stuff. Cheeky little lob from Paul Anderson in the end there. Yeah. No, well done. Yeah, thanks. Um, no, I thought it was probably what we deserved. Um, and I'm pleased for Paul because I thought he was the catalyst of a lot of our uh, good attacking play today. Um, and, it, and he was unlucky on a couple of occasions, but you know, credit to the players that they've, they've gone right to the end there. And, and I think uh, it was a well, well earned and well deserved point. Really good, strong performance, uh, strong defensive performance um, today as well, as we expect now. Monty. No, I, I think you know, we've certainly been getting stronger uh, on, on the travels. And, um, Pleased, you know, there's a lot of work going in the training ground with the boys. Uh, so I feel we look really tight and strong in our shape uh, without the ball. But again today, I know the pitch you know, would have been too critical of the players, but we were loose in possession. I thought sometimes we just made that wrong decision, cut the little balls we could have slid through, and it could have been a better outcome. But I mean, all we need, I think they've given me everything again. And uh, you know, I'm, I'm pleased with, with another away performance at the club that you know, are pushing for the playoffs and, and, and very um, lethal here at home. 51 points now, that magic number you've talked about so much. Yeah, my kids winning below, so it, it's yeah. getting bigger. But no, I mean, listen, we've just got to keep worrying about ourselves uh, and continue to put performances in because, again, you know, we've, we've been backed by a good support and, and people uh, rightly want to see the team perform well. And uh, that's uh, we did that today. And I'm, Obviously pleased for uh, Sean McWilliams there, he's coming in his league debut, thought we've done very well. Young boy with a, with a bright future as long as he keeps learning and working hard, then you know, we can see a lot more of him in the future. Great stuff, because the academy tweeted actually during the game saying if you work hard, this is your reward, and there he is, 18-year-old Sean coming up to make his um, senior debut. He made, he made good impact on the I thought so, yeah, I thought he's done very well. Uh, he's got a lot of energy, Sean. You know, he's been away uh, at Kings Lynn, learning his trade, which is brilliant, and he's come back a a person for that because he understands what it could be like outside of this football club and outside of professional football uh, and I think it gives him a really good insight to what, what it requires to be a professional footballer and he's come back you know, and uh, I'm really pleased for, for him today to get his uh, debut. All good with John Joe at all coming off or is it still a bit of a niggle? Yeah, it's, it's an ongoing one. I mean, he's limited in his training and John Joe needs to train, uh, not just only play. So it's a little bit sluggish, but you know, he's always a threat. You know, he's a presence out there. Just probably didn't run for him today. Finally, got to just quickly ask, I'm sure I'll ask you again next week about uh, Sheffield United at home, the return of a Mr Wilder. It's going to be a challenge. Yep, no, I'm looking forward to it. I mean, uh, done an amazing job here uh, last season and has continued that at Sheffield United. Um, so, rightly, he'll be welcomed back to the football club uh, with open arms. And, uh, but hopefully, we won't be uh, clapping them off you know, because we, we've still got to perform and, and we look forward to the game. You know, big crowd, uh, big game, and, and one that these players are starting to enjoy playing. Thank you, Justin. Thanks, Great result.